somebody mentioned that they were having trouble cutting corners, so I thought I'd share how I cut them. Uh, you have to think about your saw blade. Your saw blade is a rectangle, right? You have teeth here on this front. When you get to a corner, you have to stop your forward momentum and just work your saw blade a little at a time over that direction. And you can, you can feel it give, like the metal will start giving until you have room to actually turn that corner and go the opposite direction. For me, I do better turning to the right than I do turning to the left. So for this one, I would probably come in and go this way. But I'm gonna, so, I'm gonna show you how I cut a corner. And anytime I'm cutting in a tight corner, like this top piece, and I want a real sharp point, I'll come at it from two different directions. I always go at a 90 degree angle to, to the line. You can see it there, I hope so. So I cut all the way to the line. And then you can just feel it. And you're not pushing forward. You're actually just kind of staying in place. And you can feel it when it clears that metal away for you to go down your next line. So I've got my point and I back it up back into my original hole, pilot hole, 90 degree angle to the line. Holding it in place until I can feel that metal give. And then to my point. These aren't as sharp, so they're a little bit easier to do. Got to the corner, hold it in place, and just gently turn it as you feel it move. It's kind of like driving a car. You can't just do a straight automatic 90 degree turn, you know, with a car. You have to stop and turn a little at a time. And you definitely want a sharp blade for this. You don't want to use a dull blade. So if you're having trouble with your with it, and you can also use your saw like a file. There's a bump there I won't go on. Just take that away. So if you're having trouble with your corners not being as easy as they should be, make sure you have a fresh blade. Use burlap wax if you need to. This is what I use when I need it. I don't use it all the time, half time. I just power through it. Alright, here's another one. I'm going to do my sharp point first. Got my tip. I 
hope that helps answer any questions about the corners. We've got a few more to do.